Hey everyone, this is Albert. The Lord showed me a vivid vision. Part of the vision has already happened and the remaining half is going to happen. And the Lord really showed that in a very clear and a clarity way without any doubt. And also he confirmed that vision with a confirmation word. I'm going to share the confirmation word. I'm going to share the vision. It is going to bless you. It is going to bless you. and it is going to bring back president trump because that is the vision is all about and how he is doing why he is doing and there is a prophetic parallel associated with that this is going to bless you as you are interceding and praying and waiting and expecting the lord is going to bless you i would like to start sharing this vision by sharing the confirmation word that the lord gave god told me look at david in the bible we see that david was really anointed by god appointed by god while there was a season where he was really appreciated as a champion and everyone started to give credits and glorified god the reason is because he defeated goliath he was able to win the victory he was able to lead that battle in a victorious way so everyone started to rejoice and be glad that david is in the hand of god but then very short time after that it all faded away within a short time everything faded everything vanished the same people who appreciated david the same people who celebrated david as a champion the same people started to criticize david the same people started to see that david has disappeared from the scene for a while there was a season where david although he was anointed although god used him and proved amazing things through him but still there was a season which is called as a hidden season i would say there is a hidden season in david's life he was nowhere to be found and we can see that saul was searching but still he could not find david but god protected david in that season God covered him with the wings. God draw him more closer to him. And right after that we see that God really brought back David to the spotlight. God really brought him back with a power and authority and God started to use him as his hands in a powerful way. And that is what exactly going to happen in President Trump life. God showed this vision where I saw that God was holding President Trump in his hand. and everyone was really rejoicing and there's a great joy and there is a spotlight and the lord is using him through his hands and right after that season i saw the hand of the lord is there but i don't see president trump in the hand it's like as if he went missing or disappeared people the same people who really appreciated and really enjoyed the way how god did through president trump same people started to mock at him and started to criticize and complain and and they were really telling that yes god used to him and that season is over and done but i was asking god what happened to president trump in that vision immediately god really opened his uh, coat like this garment and then there was a pocket inside inside the coat and then I saw that the Lord really brought back President Trump again from the inner inner closet and then back in his hand. And that season of where President Trump was inside the heart or like a closeness with God, God said, "I held my son very close to my heart and I embraced him with my bosom, the same way how I protected David for his bull run." I have kept my son president Trump in a secret place close to my heart by but, but I energize him strengthen him equip him embolden him empower him but now I saw the lord really brought him out and then brought back to the spotlight and once again with a great power of god resting upon him with a great anointing the lord started to use him powerfully in that spotlight that is what going to happen the lord says that the same way how i used david i'm going to use my anointed servant trump god is a good god his words 
are always unique the ways of god is always unique often times people get confused about the ways of god but god confirms through his vision still president trump is anointed still he is close to the heart of god still god has a plan for him for his glory great comeback is ahead of you trust god look forward for what god is going to do in this nation of united states of america the plans of god will never change he loves this nation and he loves you the lord is calling you to pray as we are waiting in this season and time prepare i encourage you all to continue to join i encourage you all to pray every day at night 7 o'clock at 7 pm your local time declare the declaration if you are not available that time any time is okay i have put the description below the declaration prophetic declaration over america and over president trump and keep declaring and you will see the mighty wonders of god manifest upon president trump as god really brings him back out of his inner closet back in to the spotlight for his glory the time is at hand so half of the portion of the vision has already happened and remaining half is going to happen the prophetic parallel is the life of david it is going to be a powerful move of god for his glory it is going to surprise the anti trump anti trump republicans and many other people it's going to surprise them and i even heard the lord said many will quit trying to be an anti trump because of what god is going to do for his glory i was in new jersey someone gave me this silver coin where one side it, this has a president trump 45th president and on the other side i see white house um this is prophetic coin and this is a silver coin and uh, it is really amazing that the lord spoke to me today many things from this one specific coin and also prophetically the lord confirmed so many things there was a woman in the bible who had 10 coins and jesus said if she lost one coin she will search and find it one term that has been taken away will be found in jesus name and also the lord is going to redeem silver represents redemption the lord says today that he is going to redeem what was lost because he is in the business of redemption from the beginning of the world and the lord is going to redeem president trump's term and also he is going to bring back president trump in a powerful way for his glory nothing is going to stop what god has planned and spoken and this is done and it is going to happen for his glory hallelujah bible says in the book of numbers chapter 10 and verse 2 make two silver trumpets that's talking about two terms prophetically today that is relevant today god told the trumpets to be built so that they can able to use that to assemble the congregation and also to break out camps those are the two purposes why two silver trumpets are made today the lord is really telling those two trumpets that god told to build there is a prophetic parallel today where god is going to give two terms for president trump in a powerful way for his glory with man it is impossible but with god all things are possible trust in him and greater things are yet to come hallelujah the lord made the king to vindicate sarah and abraham and we see that the king gave 1000 silver coins to sarah as a retribution as a compensation as a restoration as a vindication and he told that i'm vindicating you before all the lord is going to vindicate what he has spoken through prophets the lord is going to vindicate what happened in this nation in a powerful way greater things are yet to come the things are going to change because the tables are turning and the lord is on the move and he is doing extraordinary things trust in him and wait patiently for there is going to be an amazing breakthrough for the glory of god hallelujah in the book of malachi chapter 3 and verse 3 he will sit as a refiner and purifier of silver and he will purify the sons of levi and refine them like gold and silver God is bringing purification and refinement in America. The Lord is going to make his church as pure as gold 
and silver and the lord is really raising up levi for his glory and god is really going to do extraordinary things by bringing president trump and he is going to do an amazing blessings and breakthrough for this nation in a powerful way hallelujah silver in the bible represents redemption we see that the silver was used to buy back the freedom the lord says that this nation will be redeemed for the glory of god and the lord has redeemed this nation by his sinless blameless blood you are going to see mighty harvest of souls in a powerful way the lord is going to establish this nation to a new level and the lord is going to bring back president trump for his purpose for his assignment hallelujah Finally the word of the lord is like a pure silver refined seven times that's why like god is really encouraging us to continue to pray every day 7 o'clock 7 pm for 7 minutes i have mentioned declarations that you can declare over nation over america and over president trump and it is going to really bring forth an amazing breakthrough the declaration is formed out of the word of the lord and that is relevant to today's need and declare and i encourage you to pray and god is going to do extraordinary and mighty things for his glory and he will bring back president trump soon and let's trust in the lord and put our hope in the lord and there is an amazing break through it is already happening and the lord is going to do mighty things for his glory hallelujah god bless you so much if you haven't subscribed please subscribe and be sure to hit the thumbs up if you are blessed check out the links in the description about upcoming conference come and be blessed god bless you